bit nippy. I'm going. I'm off. <laughs> I'm down. I'm going. Claire, I'm going. Claire, Claire. <laughs> I don't know if we're ready for this. Oh, yeah. Definitely in my top five saddest goodbyes in my life. We're and now we're... gonna go to Margaret! There's just a cliff. There's just a cliff in front of me. Alright, welcome to what you might think is a bit of a weird start to a vlog. <laughs> Where are we, Claire? We are in a hotel, Gatwick Airport. Yeah, not the one that smells like poo. Not the one that smells like poo, we're in a very posh one because technically we're worth <laughs> working. We are working. We've got Ray with us. Ray, this is what, Ray, what a day. What our a day. Um, producer for our podcast. Oh, and God. we're all going on holiday together because we're just, we're, we're just like this. That's it. No, family. it's a special vlog, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Very special vlog. This is a, um, we're, we're making this vlog with Crystal Ski Holidays. <laughs> They're not going to want that. <laughs> we're making this vlog with Crystal, Crystal Ski Holidays. Yeah. Joe, I'm just going to grab... Have a swig of beer. We've got the H-bomb with us. I think, Harrison, I think you might be a cameraman. Hey, guys. <laughs> you might be head cameraman. We do also have Jude here. We, got... we didn't just pick our favourite wine <laughs> and bring them on holiday. No, because it's... I'm you know, probably not the favourite. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to Yalo in Norway, and we are going with Crystal Ski Holidays, who have very, very kindly put this package for us together. We're doing it on the podcast, we're doing it on the vlog, and we are so excited. Now, they have sorted our flights, our accommodation, our transfers to and from the airport, to and from the resort. They have also helped with our ski essentials, so, you know, all the helmets ski the, passes stuff like that yeah passes to get on the lifts we're really really excited we're gonna take you guys along obviously yeah. we're gonna james apparently thinks he's gonna be really really good at this i just so. feel like i've never done we've never done it before we've never skied before at all it's something we've wanted to do for years so we do feel really really lucky that we we've been given this opportunity to yeah. do this makes a special vlog for you guys i'm so excited yeah i'm really really happy I'm not going to sleep tonight. <laughs> wow, is MTF I heard them say that I know, before? No, honestly, I'm not going to sleep tonight. We've got to be up at three o'clock in the morning to get our flight. Yeah, I'm gonna early be, start. I'm just going to be awake the whole time. <laughs> I've got a fantastic outfit to wear. I did have to rein them in slightly I'm gonna, on the outfit. Well, I wanted to get the Ned Flanders spandex. Feels like you're wearing nothing at all. That's the yeah. that's the road I wanted to go down. Yeah, don't worry, I didn't let them. But yeah, little special trip. And we're bringing you along with us. Welcome to the Buckley Ski Trip Vlog. Right, we're going to go to bed. Yes. And we'll catch up with you tomorrow in Norway. Cheers. So we've been uh, driving for a couple of hours now. We've still got about another hour till we reach the mountain where we're going to be spending our time. Just had to stop off so that Claire and the kids can go for a piss or a sh**. No judgment. Bit nippy. Absolutely stunning though. I've never been anywhere like this before in my life. Just incredibly scenic. Yeah, so far so good. I like Norway. It's all right. Skiing yet. Not been skiing yet. I'm knackered. We've settled in. Just we've, went for um, dinner. We've got our equipment ready that we need for tomorrow. Yeah. We've been up since two o'clock in the morning. Yes. We're all shattered. Yeah. So we're all just going to get into bed and stick a film on. Yeah. And probably fall asleep or whatever. Yeah. The action starts tomorrow. 
I'm you... so excited. I am too. I mean, these guys are going to be blown away. I've never skied in my life, but I just know that I'm going to be a natural at it. See, I think I'm going to be really good. Well, I'm going to be better than you. But you'll see us tomorrow. You'll see how absolutely amazing I am uh, at put skiing. Put it in the comment right now. Before this video ends, put it in the comments right now. Who do you think is going to be the best? I mean, the last time we said that about the comments um, when me and you had a fight, everybody said I'd be able to bar you. Mm -hmm. But we also have done a little competition-y thing before, and I won when we did the supercar stuff. I was faster than you, though. You lost loads of points because you went... I was faster. That's all, that's all you just no, I, I was, was fastest. But overall... No, I, I was, was fa technical I stuff. Watch, I, I was fast. Day. Anyway, we better go to bed. We'll see you tomorrow. You look at me like that. We'll see you tomorrow on the slopes. Morning gang, how's it going? Today is the day where we finally start doing some uh, some actual skiing for the first time in my life. Never skied before, but I do think I'll be really good at it. Don't know why, just always assumed that I'd be quite good at skiing. Amazing night's sleep last night, absolutely incredible. We were all watching a movie in bed, me, Claire and the boys, and the boys fell asleep. And then I did that whole thing of, uh, you know, Claire was like, oh, should we move them? I went, no, no, don't wake them up, they're shattered. We've been travelling all day. We had to wake up at two o'clock in the morning. Leave them there, it's, it's fine, honestly, it's fine. I'll go and sleep in another room. I don't mind, honestly. So I went off to another room, got in my own bed. Just had the best night's sleep I've had in years. I'm going to go and have a shower. We'll go and see what Claire's doing in a sec. Right, this is what I'm wearing. I've got my socks and long johns on already. I'm worried about that I might have gone a bit too over. I don't think so, James. No. I think we're going to be so cold. Right. Vest, then thermal top, then a jumper, a jumper then a, a fleece. No, I would, see, I would lose the jumper. I'd just go fleece. Just go fleece. Yeah. Then trousers and a jacket. I've got gloves. I've got a hat. I've got a snood. I've got my goggles, which I can't wait to wear. So just doing a fit check so far. I really like how the, uh, the tight top really enhances my bust. A little bit annoyed. Because I look like just a bit of an idiot. And you look like you're glam skiing. You look really glamorous. Well, it's not my fault, it just happens. That's not fair. I look like I've got bigger tits than you. I'm keeping all these tags on just in case I don't like skiing so I can just send my clothes you're back. You're not keeping those tags on. Yes. You look great. You look so great. Look at those things. Look, you you got, first. You've got to have a load of fun with your outfit. Oh, it's annoying. Look, you've got like a brass buckle on your belt and stuff like that. Let's go. Let's go. I'm so excited. Oh, I'm ready. Right, you've still got the tags on your hat. Yes. Yeah, and there. I might send these clothes back. No, I'm not. Take them off. It's fine, Claire. James. People do it all the time. Influence. Take them off. This is what influencers do. Stop. Take them off. You're not going skiing with tags, are you? But there's too many. Hurry too up. Many to take off. Hurry up. You want me to take the Hurry up. Off? You don't think it'd Hurry be funny? Hurry up. You don't think it'd be funny, me, on the switch? No, I don't. Place. Hurry up. I need a coffee. All right, I'll take them off. So, why are you so annoying? <laughs> Boys are ready. Is that all the tags gone? Hat. Oh, I've got some more boots. Oh, for God's sake. Let's take one. Come off. Hurry up. I'm not going skiing with you in this mood, so behave. Are you getting on there, Claire? It's quite hard to get everything on. <laughs> I'm trying to get mine on now as well. I'm managing, I'm just taking my time. You're knackered just putting the boots on. <laughs> just trying to get the skis on. Go on, Dylan. What? Are you in? Whoa. Are you sure? <laughs> Go on. <laughs> Because I'm going. I'm off. No, I can't get into this one. Yeah? yeah. How do I move now? Well, I don't know, James. I'm just trying to get mine on. Whoa, it's very slippery. Oh, I'm going to get this on. Do you need a hand? You probably should have done that before you put the skis on, James. <laughs> oh, no, come here, come here, come here. Why didn't we do this before we put our skis on, James? Okay. We're idiots. Right. Harrison's off. Right. I'll be back. Let me try and get the hang of this first. Okay, we're just learning to walk up the hill at the moment. The boys are having a bit of trouble, including James. <laughs> you're, you're walking, but you're just not going anywhere. Yeah, you look really cool, mate. Yeah, cool. yeah really cool. When we go down, we do pizza or fries. Like this is 
legs twice, let's keep us straight, and then I want to stop and do pizza. Guys, we missed the first ball from James. I missed it. He went down. <laughs> we should have put a bet on who was going to be the first to fall over. It was always going to be him. What? What? Perfect. Rock star. <laughs> I think Claire's made it to the top. Jude and Harrison are in front of me. This is lovely though. This is my favorite part of skiing so far. Taking the little lift up. I'm down, I'm down guys. It's quite difficult to get back up. My kids are down. <laughs> We're a mess. James is there. I don't know how I'm gonna get back up. I'll have to help you. Oh. Pizza James, pizza, pizza. <sighs> I pizzaed. We've got children stuck. Has Gia got the kids? Yeah, I hope so. Ray was behind me. Oh sh**, Claire, I'm going, I'm going, Claire, I'm going, Claire, 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 I'm off! What do I do? <laughs> what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Pizza. <laughs> that was embarrassing. Okay, take two on the ski lift, we're all on. If everybody can just keep the ski straight till we get to the top, we should be alright. Oh, we've got one done. Jed's done. I'll see if I can grab him. Good job, Harrison! All right, let's go. Picking up some speed here, guys. Picking up some speed. There's Harrison right there. James is here. Go on, Jimmy! Go on, Jimmy! It's ever so exciting. Huh? It's ever so exciting. This is so good. I am loving it. Harrison's doing brilliant. Look at little Jude! <laughs> Jesus Christ, I'm going to break my ankles! Here I go. Oh. Pizza! And pizza! White pizza, big pizza! Perfect! James, going very slow over there. That's so much fun. <laughs> That's so much fun. You go up and you wait on the top. I'm with you, mate. So much fun. It's so good. I'm having so much fun. Absolutely love this. <laughs> the course. We're doing the course, we're doing the course. Go on, Harrison. Yeah. Nice. Really good. Judge your next buddy. Just take your time, keep it controlled. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> right, James's turn. See if he can do this. He's gonna fall in this one. Turn, turn. 
these days. Fell at the same time. Like, follow me, break. 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 Got to break. Yeah, break. Try to control your speed. Oh. All right, just had a bit of a wipe out. I don't know if you can see, these are my ski tracks. I was coming along here, hey, someone was coming up here. Hey mate, I couldn't stop. So I just had to fall into here. Really hurt my knees, I've got to be honest. My knees bent in ways they weren't supposed to go. Oh, there's Claire. There she goes. Okay. Yeah, just had a, we just had a little wipe out there. I was pizzaing, but I was scared I was gonna crash into someone, so yeah. I just Aim for I did the I did the noble thing and I took myself Aim for out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> took myself out instead. Oh well that was great. Done a few hours skiing. Yeah. A bit tired, not gonna lie to you, Claire. No, yeah. I'm gonna have to sit down, mate. My back's killing me. We'll have a little tidy up, a little shower. Yeah, I stink. Get into some. Yeah, you do stink. I do? No, I gotta be honest, I can't. I didn't tell if you could stink or not, Claire. I, I do. And then we're doing a little bit of bowling this evening. Yeah, we got um, bowling and dinner. Yeah. Sort of American bowling alley. We're doing batteries for tomorrow. Right then, guys, we are heading out to do a little bit of bowling. I tell you what's annoying me, Claire. Me? Not you, never you. That's not how this relationship works. We're in a place where it's very low humidity and it's just <sighs> making my hair look stupid. I've not got any lift or oomph to my hair. I feel like the episode where Jerry Seinfeld, where the, they put the low flow showers in their apartments. <laughs> oh, yeah. Right, let's go bowling. Check this place out, look at this. <laughs> This is great! I know, that's what you were just saying. It's like from a second in America. You're not fast? Here we go. Still, Jimmy! Your knees and ankles are feeling a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've not changed your shoes! You've got to get your bowling shoes I'm on! I'm too cool for that. I hope you slip over and make a right tit of yourself. Get rid, of those you get rid of those rubbish. ones first. I just love it here. I absolutely love it here. Oh, it's all lit up. I want to do that tomorrow, night ski. I don't, I and think you might so have to be, be professional. Yeah, some kind of, or have some kind of experience. Okay. Oh, I went skiing today. That's it, we've done it once. We've come back to the hotel back for at, some food. They do some really great chicken wings here. Yeah, chicken wings, the chips are amazing. Yeah, chicken um, wings, chips, bed. Yeah, sounds good. Yeah, boys? Yeah. yeah. All right, let's head in. Oh, you missed him! Was you Jude, Jude was like this behind. Jude was, try, Jude was trying to snowball me. Yeah. Right, I'll follow you guys. Beer and wings. Say that again. Hey. I've got the camera facing me. What, what did you just say there? Just, Nothing. just before Claire said she really needs to go and have a poo. Great day skiing. Great bit of bowling afterwards. Oh, and then we came back to the hotel. This place does. I don't know why. 
It's a bit random. They do the most amazing chicken wings. Absolutely. We're all shattered. Yeah. We're off to bed. Catch up with you tomorrow. I'm gonna be skiing my brains out tomorrow. Honestly, yeah. I'm not looking through. How was breakfast? It's nice, yeah. I had these um, balls of meat. <laughs> I think you call them meatballs. <laughs> not you though. I'm just having my second coffee and then let's hit the slopes. All right, here we go. Just about to get the skis on. The kids have already got theirs on. They're ready to rock and roll. Bigger mountains today. You excited? Really excited. Let's do it. I didn't think I was sore, but my shins are sore. Here we go. Whoa! What? <laughs> you back, you back in, yeah? All right, getting James's first run of the day. He's heading up now. See if he remembers what to do. All right, here we go. Oh, he's sending the kids down first, as he likes to do. <laughs> here he comes. Slow and steady is old Jimmy. Oh, I think Gia's telling them to practice stopping. Here he comes. Happy with that? Yeah, very happy with that. Nice and controlled. Yeah. Feeling quite confident? Yeah. Yeah, me too. You got a tissue? No, I don't. <laughs> Claire's up there somewhere. Oh, there she is. I think she's off. She's away. Pop. A little bit of twisting and turning. How's the stopping? How's the stoppage? Very controlled, Claire. How are the kids doing? We're practicing going slower. Yeah, just nice and controlled. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good job. Right, level two now. Let's see how we get on. I thought we were going up this. I thought it was another one of those little sort of friendly child version. We're going up on this. We're going on the bloody big lift. I don't know if we're ready for this. All right, we're on the ski lift. Oh, How are oh, you feeling, geez. guys? Oh, I'm feeling okay. It's pretty nice. That's behind us. Wow, the views are unbelievable. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> I managed to do the, the ski lift there without falling over. I'm very chuffed with that. All right, guys, we are in proper ski territory now. It's a long way down. The kids are off, no fear, as usual. Struggling along, like walking like Pingu. Tell you what, it's much colder up here. <laughs> Let's see what we're doing. <laughs> doing a few rounds of this hill here up here like it does like here it just genuinely start off quite steep Claire's doing really well she can she can get down this no problem at all like I, I fall over at least once I say fall over I dive because it's the quickest way of stopping I've found this guy here hands you the little I think they call it like a button lift or something like that it's a little button that goes between your legs and he handed me one I fell over straight away couldn't get up that's another thing as well, as soon as I fall over in these skis, I cannot get up. But I think I've unlocked a new challenge in my life, which is to become a all right skier, proficient skier. I think I'll do that. I think I'll spend some time doing that. Go skiing once a year, improve, get better. Maybe find some club, some, well, I'm not gonna join a club. Let's not go mental. I could definitely get into it. It is a hell of a lot of fun. That's one of my kids there. Who's that? I can't even make that. I think that's Claire. There she goes. Here comes Jude. Watch him fall over now. Yeah. 
Here comes H bomb, nice and controlled. Well done, Harrison. All right, up on top of the mountain, we're gonna go in for a little bit of food. That was great. Yeah, really good. Sort of half, half skied, 75% ski, 25% fell down <laughs> that mountain. <laughs> good odds James it's the standing still yeah you don't like that's that. when I fall over you I just lose moving. my back I, yeah if I'm moving I, I like I'm all right yeah, if I could just I keep going. going yeah oh this is lovely all right we have stopped for lunch and man is it a lunch is it wow oh <laughs> oh yeah how's that Delicious. It's really good. <laughs> yeah. Beautiful little burger lunch on top yeah. of the mountain. Well, I actually had a, had a croque monsieur, didn't you? Croque monsieur, which was huge. Probably could have halved this with somebody, but it's delicious. I think the food was too good, and I feel like the food will maybe make a reappearance halfway down a mountain at some point. <laughs> oh, God. Well, if that happens, I'm skiing on. Excuse the mental hair, but check this out. So amazing. One thing that I'm very pleasantly surprised about is that, um, you know, your, your skiing clothing, your skiing gear works. I mean, I'm just in a vest and a thermal top right now. I think I've ate too much. Yeah, I feel a bit stuffed. I feel like that wasn't the, uh, the, the, that wasn't the smart thing to do when you're uh, doing sort of something so physical. But we'll find out. I mean, if someone's going to come to a beautiful place like this and uh and vomit all over it it's gonna be this guy all right we're about to go down this one i don't like that you can't see over the edge it's very windy look at that look at the snow coming in absolutely amazing That last run um, that we did, my nerves are a bit shot. I think I need a bit more. Um... Oh Jesus! I've been trying to keep hold of my lunch as well. I think there is no doubt who the better skier is between me and Claire, because um, she's gone all the way back up the top on the ski lift again with Jude. I think we've got to. Uh... I think I've got to remind myself that this, that, you know, has never uh, done anything like this in my life. I think. You know, we can come away with some pride. Claire's just a speed demon. She's just absolutely killing it. And so, so are the boys. Just waiting for Claire to turn up. And the boys, I'm at the bottom of the mountain again. I can just hear in the distance, there's some music playing just behind me. I don't know if you guys can hear that. But I'm just in this beautiful setting in Norway. And they've got a uh, Crockett's theme, Crockett's theme by Jan Hammer playing which a lot of you will know, a lot of you guys my age will recognise from the GTA Vice City soundtrack. Probably the best game soundtrack ever. I think they're coming down now. Who is that? I think that's Jude first. I think that's Claire behind him. Then Harrison and then Gears at the top. There's Claire there. 10 past 8. And is that all it is? It's late enough, isn't it? I know, but still. Crikey. Like midnight. Oh, my feet are a bit swollen. Absolutely. Shh, cream crackered. We're just going to sign off for the evening. We have had an incredible day. The things that we have done, I never thought possible, especially these three. Just couldn't get enough of it. I can honestly, honestly say this. I don't think I've ever enjoyed something more. It's a load of fun. Really, really like it. It's a load I of fun. I think skiing's my thing. I think it might be. You're ever so good at it. 
Oh, thank you, And the James. kids are great as well. Yeah. So the only thing about tomorrow is we don't have Guillermo, who's our, uh, who's the ski instructor. Harrison's sad. Jude's absolutely gutted. We we'll, love him. We we'll absolutely love him. I think we've, that we've exchanged um, numbers. I think that we've made a friend for life. He's invited with, yeah. us to his cabin. Yeah. And I did tell him. He was like, "You need to come to my cabin. We'd love to yeah, have you we there." Yeah. We were like, uh, and we we're like, "We're not too proud." We're not those kind of people yeah, here. No, we'll turn up. We Hello? Will, we're not going to walk away from here and go, oh, that was, that, that was very nice lovely. Jazz, yeah, that, what a lovely joke. No, we'll fucking be there. Yeah. All right, mm -hmm. gear. Yeah, so yeah. get the hot chocolate ready. Yeah. But yeah, going straight to bed. Yeah. Bedtime so tonight. More chicken wings. God, see if you don't even want to come ski and come for the chicken wings. Yeah. They're unbelievable. We've had such a great day. We did so much skiing today. Up and down the mountains. We had lunch, which you would have seen. That was in a little restaurant up in the mountain. Yeah, little it, camembert. Oh, it was abs. Everything about today was brilliant. I, I literally had the best day. And I don't ever say that. I don't like any. I don't care about any. No, I really don't. She really doesn't. I'm. I'm loving never, this. Never happy. I don't like it to be honest. It's a bit uncomfortable. Well, don't worry. We're going home. Yeah, soon. we're going home. I'll be back to my yeah. miserable self soon. Thank God. We've got two tired naked boys. <laughs> Three tired boys. Two of them are naked. Mhm. Mm um. So we'll see you tomorrow. Love you. Good night. Harrison just threw there's his... The, there's the pants to prove it. He just threw his pants at me. Sun's just coming up over the mountain there. Our last morning, really, we get to do some skiing. Enjoyed it so much. Did not think I'd have this much fun. We've lost Gear. Gear's, uh, we just said goodbye to Gear, which was ever so sad. Definitely in my top five saddest goodbyes in my life. The boys were gutted. He's our absolute hero. He's been incredible taking us under his wing and teaching us the ropes. We are just on our own, just putting what gear has taught us into uh, into practice. So we'll see how we get on. How are you doing there, Jimmy? <coughs> Shattered. Just from carrying your skis up? Yeah. We're back to the little hill that we started on on the first day. So we're gonna do a couple of runs, see how we get on. And then if we're still feeling confident with the gear, we'll move on to the big one again. So he's our safety net, isn't it? You do. It does feel like our safety net's gone. We really bonded with him. We the really kids loved him. Yeah, he was so brilliant and patient with us yeah. and made us feel so confident yeah. and good about ourselves. Yeah. The boys are heartbroken. Yeah. He has taught us the basics really well. I still feel quite confident. The boys are clearly confident. They are, oh, they're oh, already oh. on their way up the slope. So we're going to give it a go. I'm going to have to put my goggles on. It's very bright today. He's still feeling confident. Here comes Jude. Not waiting for mum and dad. Oh, he's straight into the course. What's up? <laughs> my whole body feels like a bruise. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my legs feel like that. Right, after a little sort of morning skiing session there, Claire and Jude braved it and went up to the big the big hill. So did Harrison, Harrison yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we went at the same way. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't do it. We're now, uh, oh, we've got a bus. We've got a bus here for it, waiting for us. Um, we're now we're... gonna go to Morgan Inn. That's what you do to me all the time. <laughs> we're gonna go to Morgan Inn, which is sliding down a hill, which I think is what I can do. I can definitely handle that. Although I've been having trouble in the toilet. Oh, lovely. And I hope that it's not too bumpy or something and a load of stuff comes loose. Come on in. Alright, toboggan in. Woo! -hoo. Woo -hoo. Okay, we're here, we made it. We're doing, um, we're going to get involved with some TB. And I'm not talking about the kind of the stuff that, you know, would kill you in the Wild West and sort of frontier times. I'm talking about tobogganing. You pumped, Claire? Yeah, I'm ready. It does sound a little bit scary, so I'm going to take it easy. It seems a little bit, I, I thought this would be like the easy chilled out thing. Yeah. But it seems like you need to be careful. Yeah. So yeah, we'll take our time, yeah? Yeah, keep pulling that way. Apparently break. you can go up to 70 miles an hour. Is that what the woman just Kilometers said? Kilometers an hour. Kilometers, oh right. <laughs> I can walk at 70 kilometers an hour. All right, here we go. 
tobogganing. Welcome to the Pro Tobogganing Championships. In front is Harrison H-Bomb Buckley. Behind him, his father, James Buckley. So this is gonna be a, uh, a strange race as the two are related. It's said that in their private lives, they are very close, support each other. But of course, when it comes to being professionals and when it comes to racing, the father-son relationship does go out the window to some extent. As was proved in last season, when uh, father James Buckley watched his son, Harrison Buckley, crash into a tree where uh, father James Buckley then went on to win the Tobogganon World Championships 2023. Right, it's my turn at the top of, uh, this is a mountain, right, Ray? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, top of a mountain. Give myself a little push off. Building up some speed now. Do not want to come off the side of that. There's just a cliff. There's just a cliff in front of me. Avoid the cliffs and you will be fine. actually a good idea because my bum's a bit wet yeah, from toboggan. My bum's got wet. Yeah you go and heat up Harrison. Don't get too close though. Just be careful. Right then guys we just got back from tobogganing toasting the old buttons on the fire. We're done for the day. We're, We're done, done skiing. We've done tobogganing. We've found a beautiful little spot yeah, right at our fireplace. Just in the hotel lobby. Yeah, picture perfect. We've got a couple of beers. We're gonna just play a little bit of double yeah. for an hour or so, just to chill out. I'll tell you something, Claire. Oh yeah. In it hard holding the camera at the moment. <laughs> With the arms. Yeah. Yeah. Right, Jimmy boy. Cheers. Cheers. Oh. Mm. What an incredible experience that we've had. I know. This is our last whole day. We go home tomorrow. Yeah. And I'm gutted. I could do two weeks here. Easy. Oh. I mean, I'd maybe be knocking. Yeah. But then that way you could ski day off, ski day off. Yeah, absolutely. So we never wanted to take a day off. Every single morning we woke up and we were like, let's go, let's, let's go. Let's go do some skiing, yeah. I think that we are proof that you can be a, a total novice. Oh, absolutely. And come and enjoy an experience like this. And yeah. obviously... Well, unless you're me, because what was it gear called me? A natural. That's the one, yeah. Sorry, I couldn't remember. <laughs> well, we'll sign off. We'll sign off later on tonight. But for right now, should we crack open the double, guys? Yeah, let's have a game of double. Yeah, come on in, boys. Go. Purple cat. Ah. Pencil. Pencil. Ouch. Bird. Dog. Dog. Moon. Apple. Oh, target. Raindrop. Raindrop. Frozen. Frozen. Frozen thing. Candle. Cactus. Tree. Fuck. No. What did you have? Mine. That was a dud one. We'll finish up our uh, drinky poos and we'll see you later on. Back in the room, back yeah. In the room. Look at the state of me. We are in back in our room. It's the evening of our, it's our last evening. We're sort of getting a little bit organised and getting ready to leave tomorrow in the morning. That's not true, you've just been winding the kids up, making well, them smell your feet. That was it, the boys have been on top form. I don't know what it is about ski socks. And I don't really get, I'm not really a smelly guy. But I don't know what it is about ski socks and the ski boots and stuff, but they really are making my feet kick up a bit. So I just played a little game with the kids, with both the boys. I told them that they could earn five pounds pocket money by uh, sniffing my feet. And, uh, and they both did it. They both did it. Both really good sports. You earned that money, boys. You should be very proud of yourselves. Anyway, Claire's over there, Harrison's over there, Jude's over there. We are completely shattered. It's been a very energetic, uh, especially for people, as you know, who famously just spend all their time sitting around on their ass at home. It's been a, it's been a high octane energetic holiday, this, uh, this little vacay. So we're going to go to bed now. We've got to get up early. Rubbish at this, isn't it? Jude's, uh, Jude's making me laugh. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get back at play.
lady. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's a take there that's going to be cut out of the vlog, but I said that we're going to go home to Blighty, and Jude found that re really funny. Anyway, we're going home, and we will sum up the vlog and do an outro and talk to you about how much we enjoyed ourselves in a second. Transition. Just like that, <sighs> we're home. Home. We got home last night. It's the morning. We've just woken up after an incredible trip. Absolutely amazing loved it we had so much fun as a whole family and definitely made memories that will last a lifetime oh 100 percent. i don't know way we're gonna forget that oh absolutely and even which we have been talking about we want to go skiing again absolutely. even if we do go again i think we'll always remember that this first time because it was just we all just went we love this it was so yeah it was just great it was so special and we do appreciate that this was a sponsored vlog yeah um but if you are interested in our actual opinion we are going to book with crystal ski we really like them and they looked after us and they provide a great service just again it's the package thing for skiing holidays you can get use crystal ski holidays to get your accommodation your flights all the ski gear that you need all your essentials they also offer different activities we did the tobogganing which was hilarious but they also do you know ice fishing snowshoeing cold plunges there's loads of different Sleigh little things that you can do and, sleigh rides yeah. We just had a really great experience with them, so we're definitely looking to do it again, probably next year. I'd have thought so, yeah. Or maybe Before I bit, forget everything. Maybe a bit later this year. <laughs> if you're interested in having a similar experience to us, do go and check out crystalski.co.uk. The link will be in the description, of course. If you're thinking about skiing for the first time, if like us, it was something that you'd... It's on the bucket list. ...mentioned, yeah. we'd spoken about it for years. They're perfect. If you're a seasoned skier, Again, I'm sure they'll have everything that you need. There is, there's different locations. The one that we went to in Norway was chosen for us because it was beginner friendly and all that sort of stuff. But there's loads of different options to pick from. So yeah, I genuinely can't wait to go back. Yeah, I miss it. I miss not waking up and seeing the mist Snow. come over the mountain. And oh, no. I do. I'm worried that this outro is a bit of a dampener. Cause, <laughs> cause we, are, <laughs> we are a little bit like... We're back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was really, really good. I had so much fun. I absolutely loved it. The boys loved it. They were so brave. They were great. They were just like going down these. Anyway, we've done all this. They were great. We just had our neighbour John pop over to see us and I was just saying all the same stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I think we'll be talking about it to everyone who will listen, to be honest. Thank you so much for watching this very special vlog. Yeah. Um, we hope you enjoyed it as much as we did making it. Yeah. I'm sure if you were tuning in to hear me wind Claire up or moan about stuff, you were quite disappointed because I didn't really have much to moan about over the last few days, which was quite nice. But we'll nice. be back on Wednesday. We'll be back. Normal service will resume on Wednesday, so we shall see you then. But in the meantime... Thanks for watching. Thank you to Crystal Ski Holidays. And you guys, you stay scummy, yeah?